Welcome to a Health One tutorial which will demonstrate how you may send patient files via the HealthMail service. HealthMail.ie is a new service for GPs uh, which allows a secure transfer of patient identifiable information via email. If you have not registered with, so, with it at present, I would advise you to do so on www.healthmail.ie. It may take a couple of days to process your registration. The benefits of transferring patient records this way include the fact there is no printing, no scanning, it is totally secure, and you simply need the sender and recipient to have an at healthmail.ie account. I'm going to show you how you may transfer patient records to another Health One user or indeed to a user of another software. If we select the patient Patrick Burke, right click and take the option export, you will confirm that you do want to export and you now have a choice of a temporary export or an export via email. To export via email, you need to have your Outlook set up so that it defaults to using the healthmail.ie account. If you open Outlook, select Tools or Account Settings or something similar, depending on your version of Outlook, you can configure your email choices in there. Returning to Health One, we select Export via Email. We click on Execute. Your address book should appear, or you have the opportunity to add in a new recipient. You pick your recipient on this occasion and you click OK. You may at this stage be asked to log into Health Mail if your account is not already open. However, if your Health Mail account is already open, it will transfer the chart immediately and you will see one item has been processed, no errors, that has been transferred successfully. Option number two is a two-step process and for purposes of keeping the information in one location, I have created a folder on my desktop called Health Mail Postbox or any other name you would appreciate and remember. Uh, and this can be used as a holding box between Health One and your Health Mail account. Returning to Health One, we are now going to transfer Sandra Burke's chart using this two step process. We right click, select Export, and on this occasion we are going to select Temporary Export. My Health Mail post box is already. Uh, selected as a folder there. However, if not, I would simply go to Edit. I would click the three dots at the right of the path box and I would browse to the appropriate sort of folder, select OK and then save. As this has already been done, I can now select Temporary Export, Execute and as you can see that transfer was pretty well instantaneous. Sandra Burke's file is now in my holding folder, but I also need to transfer the chart of Jordan Leahy to a non-Health One user. For this, I'm going to open Jordan Leahy's chart and I'm going to select the print icon. I'm going to select the complete HCR to print, but I'm going to print it as a PDF and I'm going to say OK. This is now offering me the option of saving as a PDF and again I'm going to save it to my desktop in my Health Mail Postbox folder. The chart appears in front of me and I can simply close that and go back to the record. If I now open my Health Mail folder and create a new email, I can attach by selecting insert attachments and this will hopefully default to my health mail post box. I may see the HCR which is the standard health one format healthcare record or I may see the PDF of Jordan Leahy. I may attach either. Thank you.